I'm sorry. We were out till freaking. Do you get this? Boot crap I early. I know what day it is. And yeah, you that get that was kind of creepy. The hubby world, dude. But, well, you know why? I told you the world's collapsing. They changed our Dollar Tree up. <laughs> yeah. Welcome to Wade's Son. Um, <clears throat> I feel like I'm gonna burp. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. This is a Dollar Tree haul, but it's a rather special Dollar Tree haul. 90% of it is what we got for Easter for all six of our grandkids and all six of our great nieces and nephews. No, our grand nieces and nephews, right? Yeah, I think that's what they Yeah, grand. Grand nieces yeah. and nephews. Yeah. Which we're treating like grandkids. Which we're treating sort of like grandkids. Pretty much like grandkids. So, uh, I'm not going <laughs> to... The first thing I'm showing you is not for that, though. Um, <clears throat> the first thing I'm going to show you... I'm going to try to get the bag out of the way so we can get some of that bag noise. There we go. Is uh, actually, I'm going to send to a friend. It's a little silly, but I know she'll like it. So I grabbed this. And I'm putting a little birthday package together. And probably shouldn't be showing her that, but, you know, what can I do? She doesn't know who it is. No, well, she'll figure it out when she sees the stuff. She's not, it's not hard to figure out. And this stuff is, like, going to be very randomly shown because I'm not, I didn't sort anything. <clears throat> so this is actually for the Easter stuff we're putting together. I got all of them, some of these bubbles. You can never go wrong with bubbles. Bubbles are fun. Oh, there should be more of these because we're doing, we got to do 12 total. We have nine boys and three girls to do, ranging in ages from, our oldest one I think is 10 and the youngest one I think is four months. I don't think there's any of them older than almost 10. He's not quite 10 yet, but he's almost there. Um, but anyway, so I had to get, you know, had to get 12 and there's only four, so there's another pack of these somewhere. <laughs> But I thought those would be kind of fun. We grabbed this for one of the youngest ones. Uh, the ones that are under about a year and a half, I decided didn't need you know, the, the things we got for the older kids. So this is for one of them. Quack, quack, quack. Thought he was super cute. We also grabbed several bags of these. Nice name brand item to put in the baskets, buckets, bag, whatever we're doing. We have buckets for the grandkids and then bags for the nieces and nephews. But uh, I wanted them all to get at least one of these nice big blow pops. So there's more bags of those in here somewhere. I don't know. We didn't sort this intentionally. We didn't sort this. All six of the grandkids have this cute guy. Couldn't help it. We were just going to do bags for them. And then I kind of went, you know, I went Michelle is what I did. We all know Michelle can't do anything on a small scale, so, yeah. There's bag one. Pretty excited to do this, though. I'm not going to lie. I'm, I was surprised to find as much still in the store as we did find. Hubby grabbed a peach tree. I am waiting for them to come back with my raspberry tea. I really liked the raspberry piece tea. But they haven't had it back in yet, so, oh well. So this is the part where the parents are going to yell at us, and I don't care. We got for the boys these Dino World Slime and Fossil Mystery Bags. You don't know what what kind of dinosaur you're getting. Here's all, I'm trying to get the glare down, there you go. Here's all the choices. Um, but... <laughs> It also has a slime pod in it. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure we're going to get yelled at for this. And I'm pretty sure I don't care. Because they're not mine. <laughs> so anyway, we did we get nine of these? We didn't need to get nine of these. What were we thinking? We only yeah. needed to get seven because the two babies don't need them. Oh. oh well. well, we got nine. I'll save some back and use it for birthdays and such. And then for the three girls, 
which we're probably going to get yelled at for not getting slime from the girls, but that's well, we okay. Got a extra ones. We do. Um, this is the One Love Pets, and it says collect all four. Again, it's a blind bag. Kind of fun. Here's your chances on what you're going to get. I like this one the best right here. This little guy, I think, is adorable. But, you know, anyway. That's what we got for, you know, like, not candy. Some of the not candy. There's a couple more things. Ooh, I just bumped you guys. I'm sorry. Um, we also grabbed, for the older children, not for the younger, these really fun sticker face books. You guys have seen me get these before for... Uh, <laughs> I just lost their names. Uh, Shyla's daughters, Emmy and Alila. They're fun. We got enough for the older kids. Excuse me. We just got done eating, so I've got the burps. We also found these really fun eggs. Uh, these are for me. <laughs> I can't even lie. I like this guy. And the Nemo one. And this little one I'm going to do something special with. Hubby liked the shark ones. Yeah, purple and blue sharks. <clears throat> so, anyway, I, that I, it's for me. Those are not for the kids at all. Not even, sort of, kind of. Of course, we had to get some grass. And so we found this bag with the multicolored grass. And it's the paper, not the plastic. I hate the plastic grass for a couple of reasons. Number one, it's not biodegradable very well. This at least will eventually break down, you know, if and when it ends up in the landfill. But I like that it was a tricolor pack. There's plenty in here for me to do what we need to do. Because I don't overstuff with that paper stuff because I didn't like it as a mama. I hated that stuff. So I'm not going to do the other mamas. Here's the other bag of the bubbles. One more. Whoops, I see the other one. And two more bags of the suckers. Now, this is also for me. Well, it's not for the kids. I haven't decided if I'm keeping it or sending it on. But it's a no-me that you paint yourself. And that's supposed to be a carrot with little Easter eggs and his little nose. I, I think I'm going to pop that off because I want to put fur on here. Um, for his little beard, but I thought it was too cute, so I grabbed it. I hadn't seen anybody else haul those, and I hadn't seen them in the stores until today. <clears throat> so there's that bag. And this bag. Ooh. Okay. So. Ooh, don't lose that. I need that. I kind of decided we were going to go ahead and do eggs but then we found these and guys I had to they're so darn cute look at these little things they're little trucks aren't those adorable so we got two packs because there wasn't enough in one for all the boys hold on you'll get your turn patience I got stuff trying to jump out of the bag so I grabbed two packs we grabbed two packs it was so fun doing this. Oh, I have to admit, we kind of had fun. Didn't you have fun? I had a blast. Are you being serious? Or you yeah, just okay. No, I, I very much enjoyed it. So, grabbed those. Thought they were fun. And then for the girls, we grabbed the Peeps Bunnies is what I'm calling them because they, they have a very Peepsy look to them. So we're going to use these for the girls. The leftovers, I don't know what I'm going to do with her telling. Just stick them in my Easter bucket and see what we do next year. Hubby wanted these, even though I had the other suckers. He really wanted these suckers because they're little Easter eggs. Aren't those cute? We only grabbed one bag of these because there's 22 in here, which is more than enough to give each of them a couple. And I had to get, I thought I grabbed two of these. I hope there's another one in that other bag. I had to get the milk chocolate flavored little... Easter eggs. Um, did you guys hear about the Palmer factory exploding in Pennsylvania? Baby, can I have my glasses, please? <clears throat> Thank you. I'm going to see if these are from from the Pennsylvania. Hang on. Yep. Reading, Pennsylvania. 
this kind of stuff might become a hot commodity for a while because their factory just exploded. Um, I'm not even lying. Like, uh, I, I know some people die. Oh, there's another bag. And I am truly sorry for those families that are going through this. And now the families that are without jobs and that whole community that's going to be so affected by this. But... Hopefully they can figure out what caused it and keep it from ever happening again, but how stinking scary. You're just at work one day and all of a sudden it just explodes. Like, it's crazy. Anyway, there's bag number two. Just to put, like, in the Easter eggs, we didn't get any jelly beans. I don't know why. We started to, and then we didn't. I don't know. We grabbed... We were getting overwhelmed, to be honest with you. Shopping for 12 was getting overwhelming. Even though we generalized it and we didn't do like specifically this child and specifically that child, it still got a little overwhelming, didn't it, hun? Yes. It was, we're not used to that. Uh, we also grabbed four bags of these little carrots. Aren't those the cutest little things? I think that was an eagle that just flew by. Where's that nest at? Isn't there a nest over by Jackson Morrow? I know there's one over by the. I know about. I know there's one over by the reservoir, Is but I thought reservoir? we had another one over here by Jackson Morrow. I don't know. Hmm. Anyway, sorry guys, squirrel. Uh, grabbed four bags of those to divide up amongst the the kiddos. Now, even though the babies can't have the chocolate and stuff yet, I will put candy in their baskets because I'm not that mean. But anyway. Hubby really liked these. He's the one that said, we have to get these. And I had to agree. And especially when I saw that little guy. <laughs> He's a little duck. He's so cute. So anyway, we got three bags of these. Oh my gosh. Look at the little lamb. Can you guys see that? <laughs> How cute is he? Uh, too fun. Hashtag reliving life. So anyway, grabbed three bags of those. And, uh, we will figure out how that's going to all get this first. Did I tell you guys I was going to show you me putting this baskets together? Bags together? The stuff together? Hold on, I got one more bag. One more bag! <clears throat> Excuse me. We also grabbed a little lamykins for the other little that, you know, didn't need to have all the other stuff. So, so soft and fluffy. I the, wish they had a blue The bow. two youngest ones get. Yeah, the two babies get the chick and the lammy. We also found these cute little doodads. These are for myself. Uh, the Disney Princess Sticker Activity Nail Stickers. <laughs> what? Where do they come up with some of the names of this stuff? But anyway, I'm going to do some of my nails after Easter. But I grabbed two. That's all I'm going to say about that. That's all I'm going to say about that. I also found this cute little kit. Mainly because I wanted this guy to clean underneath these bad boys. Because it's driving me nuts. I get super grossed out by all the gook underneath my nails. I did need some new clippers. So those will be nice to have. Some nice, fresh, sharp clippers. Hopefully they... Uh, <clears throat> Um, work well. My hair bands that I use, these bad boys, I've had to throw a couple away. They've gotten stretched out. One of them completely ripped and fell apart finally. I use them a lot, so I grabbed another pack of these. I tried to find, and this one's already kind of like sort of stretched a little bit. I tried to find more of them. I found this one ran, laying in a random spot, weren't even with the hair stuff. So, I don't know. Anyway, grab that. I also found, or grabbed some, what? Some vet noses. Oh, you're wondering what that was? Uh -huh. <laughs> um, I needed a new toothbrush. I went ahead and grabbed a pack of two. Because, <clears throat> you know, two for one is better than one for one. So Because there you go. two is one and one is none. Uh, no, I got it because I like the deal. <laughs> uh, found, oh, 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 yeah, yeah. Now I can go buy my gel nail polish because... Look what finally came to our stores. The nail lamp. <coughs> now, I haven't tried this yet. You guys tell me if you've tried it and you liked it or not. But it's the mini gel lamp to use with gel nail polish. So, for those ladies that know, you know. 
uh, I have actually one of these, not this exact one, but a lamp in my Amazon cart. I've had it in there forever in my saved for later section. Um, but I have one in my cart and it's like $13. So uh, $1.25, yeah, I'll give that a try. $2.50 when you count, you had to buy batteries to go with it. So uh, now I need to get some gel polish because I don't have any right now. I got rid of all that stuff before we left for our trip, our big adventure, and I've just never bought any more. So now I need to buy some more. Also for the kiddos and their Easter stuff, these parents are going to hate me. Stamps. And I'm not going to lie, a couple of them are for me. Because there's more than enough here to share with the, the Nana. Uh, but yeah, you know. Yeah. There. There that is. There's that. There it is. I also found they finally had more of my razors. You guys know. I buy them when I see them. So I grabbed two this time. I still have like two in there, I think. But if I don't grab a couple of them when I see them, when I go back to get them and I need them, they're gone. And I don't like that. Last but not least, guys, I bought another pack of these beautiful flower stickers. Flowered stickers. They're roses, if you want to be honest about it. They are the pop-up ones. You guys saw this in my unexpected haul that I did about a week ago. And, well, actually, I think that went up this week. Monday? This is Friday. I think it went up Monday. I thought this was Thursday. I mean, this is Thursday, isn't it? Oh, my God. Is this Thursday? Yeah, I had class yesterday. Yep, yeah, this is Thursday. Well, I'm sorry. We were out till freaking... Do you get this? Boot crap I early? I actually know what day it is. And yeah, you that, that was kind of creepy. Hubby the world's like, well, you know why? I told you the world's collapsing. They changed our Dollar Tree up. <laughs> yeah, our Dollar Tree is getting all moved around. I think they're getting ready. Well, I know they're getting ready to add. Oh, I forgot to tell you guys. Okay. Back up a little bit here, Michelle. Uh, I keep forgetting to tell you guys. Digressing. I'm actually not digressing because I'm staying on the topic of, well, no, I'm digressing. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love you. <laughs> anyway. So a couple of weeks ago when we were at Dollar Tree, I actually saw the very first um, well, no, you saw some food items that were the Dollar Tree Plus because it was like $4 for that little steak or whatever yeah, it was. Yeah. But I hadn't seen, like, other merchandise that wasn't, you know, just a dollar twenty. First time ever. Those plaques? Those, they had the big, tall yard, well, not yard decor, but, like, you stand them on your porch outside your door that say, like, welcome and stuff like that. And I meant to take a picture of it and then I got totally... I hate my anxiety because what happens is... I'll think I want to do something. I'm like, hey, I want to do this. And then I'll see something or I'll hear something or something will trigger my anxiety. And all thoughts go out the window other than just get what you want and get out. And that's literally what happens. That's one of the reasons I can't do the shop with me videos. Because I can't stay focused long enough to show you guys stuff. And I get so anxiety ridden that it's like just get done and get out. I need to get out of the store. I need to get back to my safe space. Which, believe it or not, is oftentimes just the van. But, yeah. So, anyway, the very first ones that I saw were the big Easter. It said, like, welcome. And I think one said happy spring or something like that. But, um, today, while we were in our... We call it this that store. Because, no, this store. This. this store and that store. This store. Basically, it's the South store. Yeah. They're revamping the whole store the and they're expanding stuff. So I'm telling you, they're getting ready to bring that Dollar Tree Plus into ours more so. So I'm kind of excited, but I'm kind of not. Well, did you tell them about that Dollar Tree General Dollar thing that's going? Oh, yeah. And so we have on our north end. I'm very excited about this, actually. Um, for those of you that may not know, uh, Dollar Tree bought Family Dollar. Like, what, two years ago now, I think? And they're combining and expanding all of their stores. That's how you're getting the Dollar Tree Plus stuff. Is because they're actually bringing stuff that they would have been selling just at Family Dollar into the Dollar Trees. But we have a location on our north end. It used to be a Marsh grocery store. And it's finally been bought. And they're refurbing it. And they're putting a Family Dollar slash Dollar Tree in the same building. 
I cannot wait to see how this goes. I have not seen anybody else talk about this or be in one or shop in one. That's not saying there's not videos out there. It's just I haven't seen any personally. I will try to go in and get video of it for you guys. Um, I will probably just do like a music playover and like let you tour it a little bit. Uh, well, and be next year or so and yeah it's not going to be in the next like couple weeks or anything because they haven't even started construction on that building yet the building is there i don't know if they're going to just refurb the building or if they're going to demolish the building we have a couple of family dollars here in town that they have refurbed an existing building another marsh actually is one of them and just put the store in there so it's going to be a while but if they go as fast as they did with this one over they here they only used part of that marsh right right so I mean, it'll be cool when it happens. I, I will definitely show it to you guys. <clears throat> I just don't know in what context or how I'll do it. But I, given, like I just said, given my anxiety, it's not going to be like a walkie talk through. <laughs> it's just going to be like, I'll shoot the video and show you guys stuff. But then I'm just going to put music over it because I can guarantee you I'm not going to be able to talk and, and focus while I'm, it's just not going to happen. But anyway, I think that was... All I want to, oh, I, I know I mentioned in here that I was going to show me putting these baskets together. I'll probably film that probably tomorrow because um, Saturday's looking kind of busy. And Sunday I have a couple of other things I want to record so I can have it up for next week. <sighs> I need to get back to my week ahead. And I haven't been able to get anything stockpiled. Last week at Mom's. I had so many plans for so many videos over there. We didn't get the van cleaned out because the weather was just so nasty and crappy that it would have been so dark in that garage. You wouldn't have been able to see anything that we were doing, number one. And number two, when it's like that, I can't move. My body just like says, no, and I don't. Um, and then I also, <laughs> so... I'm gonna. I'm trying not to give away too much about the Mask Monday thing, but wait till you see Monday, the Mask Monday video. You all are gonna die laughing. I'm telling you, it, it it's hilarious. Looking back on it now, it's hilarious. So, I need. You know, I'm trying to get stuff built back up, but the stuff I thought I'd be able to do and stockpile, like Mask Monday videos, I don't know. <laughs> it's a process. Michelle's a process. That's all Michelle is. It's a process. Okay, guys. I gotta get off here. Are we gonna watch this episode and wait for your mom to call? Um, unless you want to do something else. <laughs> Alright, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Big hugs. Much love. See you in the next one. Bye.